everyone so today I'm back with another video last week I actually started a new series called worth the hype Wednesdays every Wednesday I'll be posting a new video and I'm gonna be testing out products to see which beauty products are really worth the hype there's so many beauty products here on YouTube that are so hyped up like so they're so raved about so I'm here to see if they're really worth the hype this week I'm actually gonna be doing Smashbox photo finish primer this is something that's been recently talked about a lot on youtube it's very hyped up so i want to see well i've already started using it so i'm just here to tell you guys today if it's really worth the hype this retails for about 30 not about it retails for 39 dollars at either ulta or sephora so this is very very expensive it's not cheap I got it a couple weeks ago. I actually had a gift card. It's probably the only reason why I bought this, but a lot of people have been talking about it, so I bought it, and I'm going to do a review on it. I don't really have big pores. The reason why I like to buy the pore minimizing primers is because I actually have a really... I have a lot of scars right here. They're like holes in my face. So I use the pore minimizing primers or any primers that fill up your pores to help hide that because no matter what foundation I use, you can still see it. So I need something that's actually gonna fill the holes in my face. They're acne scars from like eighth grade and I still have them. A lot of people think that I've gotten that pierced. I just want to get rid of the scars or try to hide the appearance of them. Yeah, that is why I buy the pore minimizing primers. The Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer. It claims to minimize pores, locks on makeup, it reduces shine and oil, sweat and humidity resistant, and it says that it lasts for up to eight hours. So I am going to be doing a demo on this product so that way you guys can see for yourselves if it really is going to help my makeup stay on longer and also to see if it's going to reduce shine on my face. I'm going to be wearing this all day and then I'm going to record later to, so that way you guys can see the true results to see if it really helps my makeup last longer, to see if it's really sweat and humidity resistant, not that it's even hot, but to see if it really also locks on my makeup. And I'll be telling you guys the pros and the cons of this if there is any cons and yeah then i'm going to tell you guys if it's really worth the hype that's a little bit of information about my skin i do get very oily in my t-zone which is my forehead and my nose i do have a little bit of dryness right here so my skin i would say is more combination oily by the end of the day this part of my forehead is very very oily so that's another reason why i bought this when it comes out the packaging when you squeeze it out that is what it looks like This primer doesn't really fill in that part like I would like it to. One primer that did hide that very well, those scars, is the Benefit Professional. I, that was the first thing I noticed that I got when I got this primer that it didn't cover, that it didn't fill in those holes. It's not really meant for that, but there are primers out there that help with that. So it feels very smooth, it doesn't feel drying at all. So yeah, today I'm going to be using this L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte Foundation. It's actually a new drugstore foundation. I only need a little bit and I'm going to be using a beauty blender sponge to blend this all in. And I need a mirror. <laughs> I want to get the best results possible to see how good it lasts. To hold you in my heart This is what it meant to be Don't tear us apart I'm just gonna go ahead and apply the rest of my makeup And then I'll check back afterwards So I just got done doing my makeup I'm gonna go ahead, run a few errands It's about 12.02, don't know if you can see that yeah, it's 12.02 in the afternoon, so I'm going to go ahead, do my errands, and then I'll check back in a few hours to see how my makeup is hiding. 
<laughs> to see how my makeup is holding up. All right, everyone, so I'm back. It's almost eight o'clock, it's 7.48, and it's almost been about eight hours since I last applied my makeup. So this primer says that pretty much it lasts eight hours. I did also see online that you can actually apply this over your makeup as well. So as you're getting oily, you can put this on top. Yes, even if you're wearing powder foundation, and it will absorb the oil. Which I was starting to get oily in my T-zone and around my nose. Which is usually where I get oil. Just by applying this again, the little bit of oil that did start to peek through did go away once I applied this again. But honestly, like the pros of this, yes, it does control your oil. I noticed that I'm not as oily. My makeup stays on uh, just a little bit longer. Like I can't say too much. Like my powder has started to wear. All around here has worn and around my mouth. I did just eat, but I I can't say like this primer is good, don't get me wrong, but I don't believe it's worth the hype and it's damn near not worth $39. Like I really want to like this because I paid so much money for it. Like it was for it's damn near $40. But like I really like it's it is good but i just don't think it's worth 39 dollars. i don't believe it's worth all the hype i mean it does control your oils it really does your makeup lasts a little bit longer but like i said i really don't believe it's worth all that money like it's so expensive if you're oily i do believe that you'll benefit from this product like you'll see the difference as far as like your makeup lasting longer but if you're if you have normal skin i don't see how you'll benefit from this this video is part of a new series called worth the hype wednesdays every wednesday i'm going to be posting a new video testing out a new product to see if it's truly worth the hype if you want to see more videos like this and be updated as far as when i'm posting these definitely subscribe Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! Makeup is holding up. Shit. Don't break. What? <laughs> is it recording? Yeah, I am, actually. It's okay. A video. Why? What did you need? <laughs> Thanks.